Welcome to another episode of Racing to Learn. We're a nonprofit that uses radio control to get kids excited about math and science. We are parting ways with our Duratrax fire hammer here. Um, after you know a couple of months of ownership, we actually had never run this thing. We were thinking of converting it over to brushless power. Um, but uh, you know, as a fifth skill gas RC or whatnot, we just decided to keep this intact. Uh, probably go with a larger scale uh, brushless vehicle that's built from the ground up to be brushless. Uh, but um, you know, this is a pretty cool buggy here. Um, just wanted to give you guys a quick overview before we get rid of it. But uh, it's got a two-stroke um, two gas engine, so you do need to run gasoline with a premix here. Um, and this is, you know, a pretty, pretty, uh, pretty vintage um, RC here. You can see the the big. Uh, quarter scale servo there. You got your um, uh, your standard servo controlling the the gas throttle and brake. Pure correct Duratrax. Uh, you know, kind of old school. What is this? It's not AM. It might be AM. Yeah, it's probably AM radio. Um, you know, far cry from the 2.4 gigahertz systems that we have today, but just wanted to give you guys a, a view of this beast before we get rid of it. Uh, one of the things is that um, this is made by, uh, you know, made in China by uh, a couple of other companies, Feigao or FG. Uh, there's there's some other names if you Google it, but um, you know, pretty cool for its time. They had a monster truck version of this as well. Um, pretty beefy in terms of the way that it's built, right? It's a hefty car, so again, converting this to brushless probably wouldn't have been the best choice. We saw one pop up on eBay that was already converted to brushless, and unfortunately we missed that auction. But um, just giving you guys a view of this vehicle before we, again, before we decide to part ways with it. One kind of unique thing is the, the wheels and tires, they use a square, um, I can't even call it a hex, a square drive pin for the, the wheels. Um, so a little bit odd, some people will convert these over to, to run uh, HPI Baja style wheels. Let us know what you guys think in the comments. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe, and we'll catch you next time. Thanks again for watching.